The break of structure and change of character indicator with labels is available for various platforms on the Trading Finder website. From this section, you can download the indicator file for MetaTrader 4 and MetaTrader 5 platforms and run it on the chart. Traders can also read this page to understand how the indicator works and how to use it. From the navigator section, you select the indicator file and then drag it onto the chart to run the indicator. Just make sure to enable the Allow DLL Imports option in the common settings and then click the OK button. From the navigator section, you select the indicator file and then drag it onto the chart to run the indicator. Just make sure to enable the Allow DLL Imports option in the common settings and then click the OK button. Once the indicator is running on the chart, it will start to identify and draw the break of structure and change of character points within the market. Just make sure to pay attention to the common settings and enable the Allow DLL Imports option and then click the OK button. Once the indicator is running on the chart, it starts to identify and draw the break of structure and and change of character points within the market. This indicator identifies four states for us. It identifies the two states of major boss and major change of character, along with minor boss and minor change of character, and marks them with red and blue lines. This indicator is a practical and suitable tool for ICT traders who are looking for changes in market character and structure breaks within the market. It identifies this indicator is a practical and suitable tool for ICT traders who are looking for changes in market character and market structure breaks. In the settings section, options for display settings include dark, light, and auto themes. Dark applies a dark template, light applies a light one, and auto changes candle colors. Profit candles turn green, losing candles red. The general settings section covers candle calculations, defaulting to a thousand candles to identify structure breaks, marking the start with a vertical line. By selecting the dark theme option, a dark template is applied to the chart. When you choose the light theme option, a light template is executed on the chart. If you select the auto option, only the colors of the candles change, with profit candles turning bright green and losing candles turning bright red. The next section is about general settings, specifically the number of candles for calculations. By default, it considers a thousand candles and goes back up to a thousand candles to identify structure breaks and changes in character marking the starting point of the calculations with a vertical line. The next section is about the type of calculation, which can be based on zigzag lines or on candles. Just make sure that if you're going to change this setting from candle to zigzag or vice versa, write the uppercase and lowercase letters correctly. The next part is about displaying or not displaying breakoff structure and change of character labels. Here, I'm selecting the dark template and changing the number of candles to 500, and then I click the OK button. Now, my template has changed to dark, and my vertical line has adjusted from 1000 to 500. The indicator starts calculating and identifying the change of characters and boss, determining whether they are major or minor for us. Well, friends, we've reached the end of this indicator tutorial. We would love for you to share your comments and suggestions with us in the comment section. It draws for us. Well friends, we've reached the end of this indicator tutorial. We would love for you to share your comments and suggestions with us in the comments section.